So certainly don't want to waste uh, any time here because we're limited on time. And uh, I want to basically let you know that what we're going to be covering today, all right, first and foremost, uh, like we said, my name is Michael Tweel. I am here on, on behalf of Market Traders Institute. And we're going to actually discuss uh, the Sunday market open, the London breakout strategy, and really we're going to teach you, I'm going to, I'm going to teach you, if you will, how to utilize trade setups in the European session. Now, I want to go ahead and let you know, uh, before we actually get into things, that you know, trading does have its own form of risk involved. Okay? You should never invest money that you can't afford to lose, and always trade with equity management in mind. Now, there is no such thing as an undefeated season. You may incur losses from time to time, but right, the, key is, the key is to keep your profit sign and have minimal losses. How many of you understand that, right? Now, it is highly recommended that you do, uh, you know, when you start trading, you know, go to the education, make sure that you are trading as a knowledgeable and educated uh, trader, all right? So with that being said, uh, thank you, Reed, for the, uh, for the introduction, my friend. And uh, I want to let you all know that, you know, just real quick, for the past seven years, I have been uh, coaching and mentoring individuals on essentials necessary to succeed in the marketplace. Uh, I do speak to organizations and large audiences, you know, really training them on how to become a results-driven achiever. And what I can tell you is about, you know, eight months ago is when I really uh, learned, uh, you know, these strategies that I'm going to be showing you today. And I'm telling you right now, it's absolutely just revolutionized, uh, you know, my career and uh, where I'm at today. So whether you're experienced, whether you're fairly new, um, this will certainly uh, apply to you today, okay? So who is MTI? Well, MTI stands for Market Traders Institute. Uh, we were founded by a gentleman by the name of Jared Martinez. Uh, people do know him around the world as the FX chief. And, uh, you know, he founded it in uh, February of 1994, and we're based out of Lake Mary, Florida, uh, maybe Central Florida, some of you know it as that. Uh, but we do employ over 100 of the most talented staff in the industry. And over the last 20 years, they have actually you know, had the honor in working with over 30,000 clients and students from all corners of the world. And we do operate under a single mission here, which is to create successful traders. And I will tell you that, you know, since client satisfaction is uh, highly important to MTI, we have designed all of uh, you know, their interactions, client interactions, if you will, around a single sentence, and that is we never leave a client behind. Now, not only does MTI have you know, some of the be absolute best strategies uh, in the marketplace, but MTI also has some of the best expert Forex instructors and analysts in the Forex industry. Now, one specific instructor that I want to actually uh, mention right now, his name is Joshua Martinez. Okay? People also uh, know him around the globe by his call name, uh, FX Pathfinder. And uh, Joshua Martinez is actually one of Market Traders Institute's product knowledge experts. And a lot of you might be wondering, why am I actually uh, bringing him up? Okay? I'll go ahead and fill you in. But who is he? All right? Let me explain to you why Josh is the authority on Forex investing. He is MTI's product expert. He's trained thousands of Forex investors. He's turned an initial deposit investment of $500 US and generated over $39,000 uh, of profit. He's made thousands of Forex investments. He is a published author, international speaker, pro analyst, and finally, he is a full-time trader. Okay? Now, why am I actually telling you this? All right? Because he's actually created a strategy that I'm going to be sharing with you all today, and I'm telling you right now that this strategy has allowed him to really do some unbelievable things, uh, as well as myself. All right, for example, all right, back in June 5, 2011, he actually opened up a trading account uh, with just 500 US dollars. All right, now, what this actually gave him the ability to do was to trade with a micro position. And when he first started trading, I mean, maybe, I don't know, like many of you possibly, all right, he was actually, he was only making maybe 2 to $5 per trade and losing 2 to $5 per trade. All right, can anybody relate? But when he actually started going through the education all right, that Market uh, Traders Institute offers, that's when he actually started noticing and recognizing that there's patterns in the marketplace. All right, now, if we do fast forward, all right, you, you can see that he was able to take, a, you know, time compounding and build residual income, and through the course, when he was actually able to put more uh, money in, he did, okay? But he did stick with it, and that basically eventually taught him how to reinvest his money, compound, build residual income, and of course, you know, when he was able to do this, he did deposit money along the way, all right, um, which really allowed him to really see returns. And when I say returns, what kind of returns? Well, take a look at the screen there, okay, returns on uh, upwards of $4,000 to $5,000, you know, per day in profits. Okay, he was withdrawing uh, $10,000 at a given time, and what once took him six months working five and a half days a week to make as a, uh, as a personal trainer, actually, you know, he was able to now do this in just one day, okay? Now, he, uh, he actually personally told me, that when he was able to start withdrawing this kind of money, I mean, it dramatically really changed his financial life, uh, lifestyle, if you will, uh, for the better. And, I mean, he's even had days where he made 7,000 U.S. dollars, okay? 
let me ask you this, how many of you would like to learn this skill, all right, where you can eventually get to this point to generate this type of income, all right? And I know it might be a rhetorical question, but it's a very uh, important question because, you know, that's what I'm going to be showing you today, and it can literally uh, set you up to accomplish these, uh, you know, these same things. I'm not saying you're going to accomplish this overnight, those results, but it can definitely um, start setting you down that path. Now, if you take a look at his track record, okay, which is third-party verified, uh, you will see that he actually has a gain of 4,548.82% return on his initial deposit investment. Now, take a look at the bottom, okay, you will see um, the graph of his growth, all right, and it actually shows where he's making money and losing money, maybe you see that, but then all of a sudden you notice that things actually rapidly took off, right, a ra pretty rapid rate, well, we like to call this a tipping point, and what I'm going to be showing you today is actually, I'm going to be showing you the strategy that's really uh, been able to assist Josh in actually finding his tipping point to help you and assist you in finding your tipping point faster um, if you haven't already done so, all right, now, to kind of celebrate his accomplishments back in April, all right, his biggest day was actually uh, 8,800 U.S. dollars in just one day. And let me ask you this question, okay? I'm not saying you're able to make this starting tomorrow, but what if the strategy I'm going to be showing you here next um, will actually allow you, and, and it will allow you to begin to just, you know, start making two to 5,000 U.S. dollars in just a single month. All right, how many of you would like to learn that? Type in a yes or a no. Awesome, Scott, Michael, James, and um, you know we have we have a lot of people in the room. So yeah, see everybody typing in the uh, yes is there. Okay. So with that being said, let's go ahead. Let's get right into things. I am going to go ahead and uh, pull up my charts. Let's get right into the live market. When you see my charts put up on your screen, can you all please be so kind? You just type in a Y for yes. Let me know that you see my screen. Uh, that you see my charts up on your screen. All right, perfect. All right. So to get right into things, I want to let you know that in front of us, okay, this is our wealth acceleration software. Now, uh, this is the software that we actually provide all of our students with here at uh, Market Traders Institute who do decide to enroll in our Ultimate Traders Package on Demand program. Now, I know that we have some experienced traders in the room, and we also have some, you know, novice traders as well. And what I want to do right now is this. I want you to go ahead and uh, write down these six uh, specific pairs that you see up on the screen, all right? And, uh, you know, if, actually, depending on the PC you're using, you might be able to just kind of click a button on the top right-hand side, okay, and, uh, and maybe take a little snapshot there of the screen. But anyways, once you write down all right, these six pairs, go ahead and just type in the word done. Uh, let me know that, that you have them written down, okay? Now, the reason I want you to actually write down all these pairs is because I am going to teach you a strategy that you can actually apply in all six of these specific pairs. All right, now, these are all in one-hour time frames, all right? If a lot of you can notice that. Uh, maybe you have, maybe, ch maybe you haven't. But I want you to go ahead, once, and a lot of you are typing in the word done. Okay, perfect. So in front of us, what we're going to do right now is I want to actually pull up, let me pull up the pound, all right, New Zealand. Now, I just pulled up the pound New Zealand, and for those of you that don't know how to read the Forex market, okay, it's actually a really, really simple thing. Now, each one of these candlesticks represent price interest point over time. All right, now each of these bars, all right, represent 60 minutes of time. Now, you are going to have uh, white bars, which you see. All right, and these white bars, they basically mean that the price has fluctuated and gone up. Okay, then you have dark bars. Now, these dark bars, which basically mean that the market has decreased all right, or gone down. Now, one thing I want you to notice is the way this market actually moves. All right, this market moves in what you call a wave-like pattern. And what I mean by that is this. The market likes to create lows and highs. So here you see all right, lower lows and lower highs, lower lows and lower highs. All right, how many of you see that? And so you have to understand that what goes up must come down, what goes down must come up. It's the very first thing you want to understand. Now, the great thing about the Forex market compared to other markets like, you know, like options and, and uh, some other markets is that if you want to buy the Forex market, all right, just buy it, okay? And if you want to sell the market, just sell it. There's not, you know, many options. Does that make sense? You can only either really buy or sell the market. Those, that's it. So you basically, I mean, if you really think about it, you have a 50-50 chance of being right Okay, or being wrong just by simply guessing. And I'm not telling you to guess. Okay? I already told you you don't want to gamble in this market. But I want you to think about that, which means if you had a decent strategy, how many of you agree that the percentage will actually fall highly in your favor? Right? How many of you agree with me? Absolutely. Okay. So with that being said, what I want to do is I want to go ahead and I'm going to, let me go ahead and just go to a blank, uh, blank spot on the chart here. Okay. The very first thing I want to do right now is this. I want to draw this out for you first. All right? I'm going to draw out the strategy, 
and I want to draw out just so you can have a better understanding, and then I want to actually show it to you and show you how it actually uh, works, because this is spatially a little bit easier for you to follow uh, along. Okay? Now, the neat thing about the Forex market is, that I absolutely love is that it does the same thing over and over and over again. Day in and day out, it does the very same thing. Okay? And it, I'm telling you right now, it has a very high percentage of providing the same signals using, all right, well, actually, let me say usually during the same time frames, okay? and usually during the same areas as well. Now, the one thing that I want you to, to uh, notice and what I'm going to do, let me just go ahead and draw this out real quick, is I want to draw, let me draw this here. Bam, bam, and there we go. Okay, so with that being said, the one thing I want you to realize and understand is that one of the areas of the market okay, that it's provided for you is that the market will provide a high and a low within a 24-hour period. Okay, so you're going to be able to actually see that, especially on the one-hour time frame. So if you're taking notes, okay, for those of you that are uh, following along here, I'm going to put high and low down here, all right, and then let me go ahead and duplicate that and place it up here, okay? So understand that the market is going to provide you within a 24-hour period, all right, a high and a low. Now, I did mention before, like I said before, okay, the market will repeat itself over and over and over again, all right? The market will form its first high or low between 2 a.m., and 5 a.m., all right? So once again, let me go ahead and write that down. The market will form its first high or low between 2 a.m., okay, Eastern time, and 5 a.m., all right, 5 a.m. Eastern time, okay? Now, once I put that there, okay, so once the market actually creates first uh, high or low, the one thing I want you to realize is that Notice that's a three-hour time difference. So within a three-hour time difference, it's going to form its first higher low. Now, the reason I put that there is because I want you to notice, um, you know, when it creates its second higher low of the day up here, all right, let me go ahead and show you what time frames that actually forms. Okay, that's going to form typically between 8 a.m., all right, Eastern time, and 2 p.m., okay, 2 p.m. Eastern time. Now, let me ask you all uh, a question here. Do you, do, would you agree that it's easier to find the higher low than a three-hour time frame than it is between a, you know, let's call it a uh, six-hour time frame? Okay, how many of you agree with me? So, and the reason I put that there is because that's the distance covered between the low and the high, all right, or the high and the low of the day, and that is known as the average daily trading range, okay, or uh, you might know it as ADT, okay, and that, uh, I'll tell you right now, that can actually, um, you know, be anywhere between 50 pips to 200 pips with a single day, depending on market fluctuation. So what I want to do right now is I want to go ahead and to reiterate that, I'm going to put, let me just put ADT, okay, all right, plus 50 pips and 200 pips, okay? So once again, that's what you can expect in a, in a, in a single day, depending on fluctuation. Now, one thing I want to go ahead and, uh, and understand that the, the question is, okay, the question is, what is a pip and what is it worth to me, okay? I want you to realize there's three major lot sizes traded in the Forex market. And look, depending on your actual investment, that will depend on what your ROI will be, okay? So for example, okay, if you just start off with a very small lot size, it's called a micro position, all right? In a micro position, you're going to actually invest about $20 per trade. Now, if you're investing a micro position, and that's about, I'm going to put here $20 investment, all right? So $20 invest. And with that, understand that each pip, okay, your goal is to collect pips, one pip equates to about 10 cents, all right? Now, if we bump it up to the next size, all right, you might want to be trading in a mini law investment, and that means that you will invest about $200 per trade, and that $200 per trade, all right, so I'm going to put $200 invest, and that $200 um, uh, invest per trade, all right, each pip with that is going to actually equate to approximately, to approximately $1, all right? And then finally, all right, the ultimate goal is to what? All right, the ultimate goal is to eventually get to something called a standard lot. All right, and a standard lot is actually a $2,000 investment. So I'm going to put $2,000 invest, all right, and each pip, all right, is equates to 10 US dollars. So with that being said, understand that this is, these are your options. Now, I will tell you this, all right, let's just say on the low end you make uh, 50 pips per day. All right, that's either $500 with a standard position, $50 with a mini position, or $5 with a micro position. Now, just so I can get a better understanding of who we actually have in the room today, I might just go ahead and just uh, type into the chat box real quick. If you think you're a standard lot trader, type in 2,000. All right, and if you think you're um, you know, a mini lot, 
just type in just type in 200. Just let me know just so I have a better idea. All right, cool, Willie and Darren and uh, awesome, Paul and uh, Parika, Tom, Bill, Robert, and everybody else. Wonderful. Okay, sweet. So understand this, all right? Let's let's just look at the majority of the room. All right, let's just say they're starting out at around a mini lot, which is pretty normal. Right? And for those of you out there, um, you know that that are at a twenty dollar investment, just understand that when you trade a micro position, all right, we set the expectation that's not really life changing. All right, it's really more like study income. Okay, so it's a great place to start to study to learn, all right, and eventually build your account up, of course. But but that's when you're really going to learn, uh, you know, go through the learning of the habits, if you all right, and the strategies, and that's how you're really going to progress. Now, for those of you already at a standard lot investment, I think that's fantastic, and I think you have a competitive edge, but. With with these uh, with that being said, let me go ahead and show you all right what our strategy does, how it holds true, all right, and that's that's the first thing. So my goal is for what is to actually um, help you and allow you to build confidence. So with that being said, let me go ahead and just clean this up, all right. Now that we covered some of the basics, and I'm going to go ahead and drop drop this back down, and I want to actually back the market up. All right, I want to back the market up here just a little bit, and I want to show you something. Well, remember how we talked about the market will form its first. All right, higher low of the day, all right, between the hours of uh, 2 a.m. and 5 a.m. So with that being said, what I want to do is I want to actually show you how that holds true. So if I back the market up, what I want to do, let me compress the charts there. I want to go ahead and find all right, the previous, the previous um, time. Okay, how many of you notice right here, all right, the, the actual the market right there, okay, 2 a.m., okay, the market actually formed. Um, its first lower high. So if we advance the market forward to say 3 a.m., how many of you noticed the market created all right, its first higher low? But take a look at the actual push that the market actually, that, that took place soon thereafter. How many of you see that? That directional push right there, all right, going in an upward manner. And same thing. If I go back, all right, and I go to the previous, if I go to the previous uh, 3 a.m. candle. One thing I want you to notice is same thing. All right, take a look at the push and. Once again, I can go on and on and on and show you how this holds true. Okay? Now, I, would, I do want to get into the actual strategy, but the one thing I want you to notice is how many of you notice the directional push that takes place uh, right, within those time frames. All right? Let me show you one more example here. And if I back this up once again to, let's, let's go to 3 a.m. or 2 a.m., okay, 2, 3 a.m., how many of you notice the market forms its first higher low and then it creates a directional push down towards the south? All right, so give me a Y for yes if you're with me so far, and let me show you um, how our strategy actually um, holds true here. Okay, perfect. Thank you, Gerald. Thank you, uh, Darren, Bill, and everybody else. All right, so with that being said, let me go ahead. I'm going to back the market up here, and what I want to do is I want to take it to current and show you how this actually holds true. So the first, the first date that I want to actually start with, all right, the first date and time that I want to, that I want to start with, let's go to, let's see here. Um, all right. Let's start right there, all right? So I'm going to go, I'm going to back the market up. Now, for those of you taking notes, the first thing I want you to write down is I want you to write down this time frame. I want you to write down 3 a.m., all right, 3 a.m. Eastern, Eastern time. Why do I have you write that down? Because understand that we are going to, the way this works, we're going to be looking for the 3 a.m. candle, okay? And the 3 a.m. candle is what we're going to actually uh, base everything on, which will, which will basically um, enable us and allow us to use our strategy. So if we have the first higher low between 2 and 5, we are going to go with the 3 a.m. candle. So with that being said, take a look here. How many of you see this 3 a.m. candle? Now, our box information tool, this will provide the date, the time, the open, the high, low, close, and that right there is where we're going to start. So the first thing you want to do, okay, the very first thing you want to do once we identify our 3 a.m. candle is we want to actually go ahead and Place, we want to place a green line 10 pips above the high. So we're going to go ahead and place up, all right, 10 pips above the high. So we're going to go up 10 pips and we're going to drop our high right there. Now, we're, we're, going, to do, we're going to do the very same thing, except we're going to drop, all right, we're going to go ahead and we're going to put an entry sell, all right, minus 5 pips below the low. So we're going to drop down 5 pips, okay, and we're going to stop right there. So with that being said, let me go ahead. And write this down. Let you know what we just did. So we placed, we placed our entry buy. All right. We placed our ent entry buy plus ten pips. All right. Plus ten pips above the high. Okay. How many of you see that? So, with that being said, where did we place 
the minus five pips. Well, we placed minus five pips for the entry cell. I'm going to put entry cell here. All right, minus five pips below below the low. All right. So once we go ahead and identify that, what are we going to do next? The next thing we're going to do is we're going to actually advance the market forward. And what we're looking for now, remember, these are pending orders. Okay, the market must cross one of these. All right, in order. Uh, within a two-hour time frame, basically, to tell us what we need to do, okay? Market buy or market sell. So let's advance the market forward one hour, two hours. And if you notice, within two hours, the market crosses to the entry buy. So first thing we're going to do, all right, first thing we're going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to place a mark right there. Now, let me go ahead. We're going to delete our entry sell. All right, we're going to delete that. I'm also going to delete that right there. Now, the moment we have our entry buy. We've identified our market buy. I'm going to go ahead and change this, and we're, going to, we're now going to call this our market buy. Now, the moment we have our market buy, all right, understand where am I going to place my stop? Well, I am now going to place my stop okay, at the low of the 3 a.m. candle. So there's a 3 a.m. candle. I'm going to place my stop right there. All right. Now, for those of you that aren't really sure what a stop is, understand that a stop is basically, um, it, it basically automatically takes you out of the market so that you don't incur our larger losses, okay? So it basically, it protects you, if you will. All right, so I'm going to put my stop at, at the low, all right, at, at the low of the 3 a.m. candle. Now, once I go ahead and do that, all right, what's the very next thing that we want to do? All right, we want to go ahead and we want to go ahead and place all right, figure out what is our target. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to go ahead and use my pips. I'm going to take my BI tool, and let's go ahead and measure what is our risk. All right, well, our risk is, all right, our risk is 70 pips. How many of you see, or sorry, our risk is 67 pips. How many of you see that? So our reward, all right, our reward is going to be 67 pips. So we're going to go ahead and place a mark at the 0107. All right, so let me go ahead and do that at place the mark right here. Okay, right there, okay? So once we go ahead and place our award, understand that this is what our goal is. Our goal is to achieve, all right, is to achieve 67 pip reward. Now, understand, okay, 67 pips. Now, understand that our goal, okay, is to achieve a minimum of 50 pips, okay? So let's just say our risk was 32 pips. We're still going to go after a minimum 50 pips, all right? So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to advance the market forward. So we have one hour, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, 14 hours into the trade, and we basically, we hit our reward. How many of you see that, okay? So 14 hours into the trade, we are now at plus, all right, 67 pips, or, and by the way, everything I'm showing you is as if we're trading a standard lot, or 670 US dollars profit, okay, in 14 hours. How many of you would be okay with that? How many of you would be okay, all right, setting yourself up, and then basically sitting, into the, sitting on that trade until it hits your reward, until it hits your goal? Now, the very next thing we're going to do is what? We're going to repeat, the, we're going to repeat ourselves over and over and over again. So let's take a look. That's at 1900. So let's advance the market forward. And remember, we're looking for our next 3 a.m. candle. So once again, we're going to keep advancing forward here. Let's take a look. And there's the 4 o'clock. So there it is. There is my new 3 a.m. candle. So first thing we're going to do, let's go ahead and clean this up. I am going to place, all right, let me go ahead and delete that. All right, we're, what are we going to do? We are going to place our green line 10 pips above the high right there, and we're going to place another minus five pips below the low, all right, right there, okay? So once we have that, let's go ahead and we're going to repeat ourselves. Now remember, I'm going to show you one more, and then I'm going to ask you, I'm going to have you take me through the following, all right, through, through the following rest of the example. So once again, we're going to place, we have a market buy, all right, our market buy order is plus 10 pips above the high, and then we're going to place all right, our market sell, and that's going to be minus five pips, all right, below 
the low. So once we go ahead and do that, what's the very next thing we're going to do? We are going to what? Advance the market forward, and we are looking for our next opportunity. So one, one hour, one hour into, the tr into, uh, into our setup here, understand that we basically have already identified that we are going to go ahead and we're going to enter into a market buy. So let's go ahead. We're going to shift. We're going to basically turn this from a market buy to, all right, Sorry, that was actually going to be entry buy. Now that's what? That is now a market buy. How many of you how many of you are with me so far? Okay. Let's go ahead and delete that. Remember those were those both, those were pending orders, all right? Now, I'm gonna delete that. What am I gonna do? I need to place my stop. So I'm gonna place my stop minus five pips, all right, minus five pips below the low. So there's the low, minus five pips, and all right, now. What I want to do, all right, is I'm going to actually I want to test I want to test some of you uh, as I show you this, all right. Now, one thing I want you to understand: a lot of you are wondering, Mike, can I sell this? Can I do the same thing selling the market? Absolutely, 100%. It works in the opposite direction. But understand that um, you know, based on your stop, if you're selling the market, you're going to place your stop, okay, plus five pips above the high, all right? Yes, uh, Kath. Kathleen Morzin, I'm very happy with what she said, okay? She said, I thought the stop was at the low. The stop is at the low, okay? And what I actually accidentally mixed up my words, so I do apologize. Thank you for catching that. But the stop is going to be placed at the 3 a.m. low, okay? And when, if you're selling the market, the stop will be plus five pips above. Does that make sense? All right, make sure I didn't confuse anyone. All right, just give me a wife for yes if you're with me. All right, perfect. So. Once we place our stop, what are we going to do? Let's take our risk to reward, and we are now going to take a look here. So let's take a look at what our risk is. Our risk is 74 pips, all right? So what's our reward? 74 pips, and that's going to be at the 0214. So 0214, and that is right there. All right, so once again, let's go ahead, and we're going to, we want our reward. So our reward is going to be, plus 74 pips, all right? Now, once we go ahead and have that identified, let's advance the market forward. We now know what we're trying to accomplish. Let's take a look. One hour, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight hours. Eight hours into the trade, we indeed hit our reward, right? How many of you would like to place do this? Eight hours later, you indeed hit your reward, and you are now up 74 pips. So we're up. 74 pips, or at a standard lot, 740 U.S. dollars profit, all right, in eight hours. How many of you are catching along? How many of you like the strategy that I'm showing you? And how many of you believe, all right, it's something that, that you see yourself doing? And listen, you know what's funny? Something somebody One time somebody told me, like, Mike, I don't want to wake up at 3 o'clock every single morning to do this. Well, listen, I'll wake up at 3 a.m., do this, go back to bed, and it beats waking up and, and you know, you know, fighting traffic, going to work 10 hours a day. How many, of you are, how many of you are with me, right? So with that being said, once again, we're going to repeat the process, right? We are looking for the next 3 a.m. candle. So I'm going to advance the market forward. All right, same thing, same exact thing here, okay? Once again, I'm going to advance the market forward, and we are looking for our 3 a.m. candle. So once we go ahead and identify our 3 a.m. candle, which should be coming up right, all right, there we go, okay, right here. So let me back this market up, sorry for that, and all right, so once we identify our 3 a.m. candle, we're going to repeat the process, right? So now I want to ask you, now it's time to, to do a little bit of interaction here. How many of you can tell me how many pips, where are we going to place all right, our entry buy? Our entry buy is where? Bingo. 10 pips above the high. Now, where are we going to place the entry sell? Bingo. Minus five pips below the low. All right. So once we go ahead and we have our entry buy, I'm going to place my entry buy. Same thing, folks. It's a very repeatable uh, pattern here. Entry buy plus ten pips. All right. So plus ten pips above above the high, and then where am I going to place my entry sell? Same thing. My entry sell is going to be. All right. Minus five pips below the low. So once we identify that, what's next? 
right? And don't forget, this is all 3 a.m. here, okay? We're going to advance the market forward, and we're going to wait to see, are we going to market buy or market sell? So one, one hour into the trade, one hour into the trade, we've now identified that this is, this is indeed going to be a market buy. So let's go ahead. We're going to go ahead and place our market buy. Remember, the two previous were actually just pending orders. All right, and where are we going to market buy? Right here, all right? Now, we're going to delete this. We're going to go ahead. We're, we deleted our opposite pending order. We are now going to place our stop. Where are we going to place our stop? Bingo. At the low of our 3 a.m. candle, right there. So we already talked about why you place a stop and what a stop is. So I'm going to place my stop at the low of my 3 a.m. candle. And what am I going to do now? Let's take our risk to reward. So what's our risk? Well, we are risking 45 pips. So that means we're going after 45 pips. However, what did I tell you? We want to go after a minimum of what? Bingo. Gerald, paying attention there. I see that. 50 pips. So 0, 2, 0, 2, 4, 1. All right? 0, 2, 4, 1. Bam. Right there. So what's our reward? We are going after. All right? We're going after plus 50 pips. Now, how many of you are now starting to catch on to this? Every example I give you is starting to make more and more sense. Now, what I'm going to do, because we are, um, I'm, looking, I'm keeping my eye on the time here, right? So I want to try to show you as much as I can, but also show you what we're going to be doing for you today. So once again, let's go ahead, advance the market forward, one hour, two hours, three hours, four hours. Four hours later, we hit our reward. We're at 50 pips. How many of you see that, okay? So four, in four hours, in four hours, we are now at plus 50 pips or 500 US dollars profit, okay, in four hours. How many of you, how many of you are, are liking this? How many of you are now understanding why, okay, we actually call this what we, what we, what we do, all right? So once again, understand, folks, that the last three mornings you've been trading, Take a, look at, take a look at your profit so far. So what are we going to do? Once again, we're going to go ahead and repeat the process one more time. Now look, I'm going to show you one more example here all right, uh, for the sake of time. And, and by the way, uh, my goal was to actually show you current market, okay, where we stand. Um, I actually didn't, you know, I should have, I should have judged the time a little bit better here. But let me just, let me just show you one more, uh, one more example here. All right, so same thing. Okay, let's go ahead. We're going to clean our charts up. Now, let me ask you all this, all right, as I go ahead and advance the market forward here. We're looking for our 3 a.m. of the following day, all right, and whoops, all right, sorry about that. All right, so once again, all right, so we should be good to go. All right, now, once we identify our 3 a.m. right there, we're going to repeat the process. How many pips above the high? 10, correct? All right, so we're going to go 10 pips above, and then we're going to do what? Where's our entry cell? Bingo. Five pips below. So there's our entry cell. Once we go ahead and identify our entry buy, all right, entry buy plus 10 pips above the high, and our entry cell, same thing, okay? Entry cell is going to be, all right, and the reason I keep typing this out, by the way, is because, you know, it's, it's retention. You know, the more you see it, the more, the more you really start to get it, but take a look here, right? Minus five pips below. Okay, below the low. Now, my goal, my goal for you, what I want to ask you is this. How many of you, now understand that two hours, let's see, all right, two hours, three hours into the trade, we basically hit our mark. Now, what are we going to do now? We are going to simply, we want to market buy, all right? So this is now going to shift. This is now going to be my market buy. And I'm going to delete my opposite pending order. We're going to place our stop where? Right, we're looking for a 3 a.m. candle. So right there, we're going to place the stop at the low of our 3 a.m. candle. All right, how many of you are with me? How many of you see yourself doing this? My question to you, how many of you legitimately see yourself being able to do this? And as a teacher, as an educator, am I, is this making sense? Am I doing a good job of that? All right, so take a look here. What's our risk? 73 pips. What's our reward? 73 pips. If you don't know what I'm looking at, take a look at the top left-hand side of the screen. That's where you see range. It's pips. 0492. 
So 0492, all right, is my reward. Let me go ahead and, all right, type that in. So we're, we're going after 74 pips, all right, and let's go ahead once again and, and, uh, and place that. So real quick, let me just do this once again here. All right, so 74 pips, we're going after, all right, so 04, 0493. All right, so 0493, and we're going to drop it right there. So once again, all right, remember, this is my reward. This is what I'm going after. We're going to advance the market. One hours, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen hours. Thirteen hours into the trade, okay, we take our reward, and once again, in thirteen hours, 774 pips, all right? So how many of you, all right, would like to generate 74 pips? All right, in 74 pips or 740 US dollars profit at at one standard account. Okay, so one standard lot, 740 dollars profit. All right, in 13 hours. So, because of the time frame, folks, what I want to do is this. I want to keep moving here. A lot of you are asking me. Uh, Charlene's asking me. Um, you know, how do I get my hands on the software and and all that good stuff? So I'm gonna. All right, I'll answer that. Let me um, let me do this. Let me pull up the calculator and let me just show you something. Okay, and I could go on and I can go on. Let's just add this up. 500 US dollars plus 670, plus 740, plus another 740 is 2,650. So the question is, how many of you would like to generate $2,650 profit, all right, in four trades in less than a month? All right? And by the way, when I say less than a month, folks, that's like, that's like less than 10 days. How many of you would like to get to a point where in less than a week you can start generating this type of profit. Give me a why for yes if this would benefit you in any way, shape, or form. Okay, so that is the potential. That is where we stand. That's the strategy, folks. I'm telling you, it can absolutely just revolutionize and change everything for you. And here's what I want you to do: type in a yes if you found this to be easy to follow. Okay, if you thought this was you know easy to obey. Okay, and if you thought it was easy to execute. All right, and and listen, I mean, if you know, in an income uh, of three to five thousand dollars a month, especially to start with. How many of you would really like that? And so that's what I really want you to imagine is what would this uh, do for you? So with that being said, I want you to hear from just a couple of our students. This is Thomas S. He's a pastor from Ontario, Canada. Says, I made $4,500 in my first week. Anthony S. from Trinidad and Tobago says, I would say about a month after I started to see a return on my investment. An average month, I'm trading, I'm making 3,000 plus pips. Here's Peter Cook. So I did Josh's pound Australia and it took me to the limit, just as Josh said. All right, and then he ends up saying it was good for 80 pips. FX Caddy, I've struggled for several months, but my rep got me focused, and I've made 575 pips in two weeks. My goal was 800 a month, but I think I'm going to kick it up. All right, and then FX MPX, 144 pips in the last 24 hours, 96 pips this morning alone. Folks, I want you to ask yourself, do you see yourself having this kind of success? Now, the reason our students are able to achieve these results is because Josh Martinez is one of your hosts. All right, and he's going to be basically paving the way to make this possible for you. And as I mentioned before, he was able to get to a point where he went from being brand new, not even knowing what a PIP is, to generating 8,800 in just one day, all right? And I want you to hear from Christopher Pulver. Now, Christopher is one of MTI's lead analysts. He's direct supervisor over world-famous analyst on demand. He's a private money manager. He's made thousands of Forex investments. He's an international speaker. He's a pro analyst, and he's a full-time trader, and he knows how to get results in the market, okay? And why am I showing you that? Because I want you to see here, take a look at his uh, track record, which is third-party verified. You'll see his uh, graph of his growth, all right? So you'll see he has a gain of 60.56 return on his initial deposit investment, all right? So what are we going to be doing for you today? Take a look. Let me just give you the details of the program. First, you are going to receive four live market online Forex sessions per month. This is a $3,994 value, okay? Now stay with me. So I'm going to show you how to get this for just 17 US dollars. Now, these four sessions are six-hour trading blocks where they're going to basically uh, be trading live right in front of you, all right? Now, let me talk about this. You're also going to receive one Forex market preview video each week. So you're going to gain exclusive access to the market analysis Josh does weekly and the possible scenarios that he will be looking uh, to trade and take advantage of when the opportunities do present themselves, okay? Now, this does include an email reminder each week uh, containing the Forex market preview video where Josh will be sharing the currency pairs that he's uh, looking to trade for that particular week, all right? Now, you are going to basically, this is priceless because this is on-demand education. So each of his sessions, all right, they will be recorded. So 
even if you can't attend live, you will be able to listen and, and really extract the knowledge of what they're going to be discussing. All right? And then finally, you are going to receive four special bonus offers today. Bonus one okay, is uh, basically 30 days free of Market Traders Institute's VIP Analyst on Demand service. Now, this does provide you with the ability to chat live with our dedicated team of um, analysts on past, present, and potential future market activity all right, 24 hours per day, Monday through Friday. Now, this alone is 997 US dollars. The second bonus that I want to include is four Forex lessons from MTI called Introduction to Currency Trading. Or you will uh, learn specific uh, information regarding what the Forex is, equity management, trading Japanese candlesticks, and how to potentially leverage support and resistance in your favor. All right? And also bonus number three is that basically it's a profit plan consultation call that does have a value of $900 and, uh, sorry, $595. Now, this will allow you to receive the same profit plan that helped Josh turn an initial uh, investment deposit of $500 to 39,000 US dollars. And finally, fourth bonus I want to include is a special ebook that helps us become successful. All right, that's what helped me become successful. 10 keys to successful forex trading by no other than Jared Martinez, all right? Now folks, all of these bonuses will be free today. So quickly, let's cover a recap. Four live market online forex sessions per month, one forex market preview video each week, recorded replays, plus on-demand access, four free bonuses. Folks, this right here comes out to 7,400 US dollars. The normal price of all of this is 297 US dollars, okay? However, I really want to help everyone get started today by doing something pretty special. We normally don't do this, but normally you would be paying 297 US dollars, but that's not the case today, all right? Today, you have the ability to get involved for just 17 dollars, folks, 17 US dollars. Now, for your first 30 days, that's it. Now, every month thereafter, you're also going to be able to continue the education for just $147 a month thereafter, which is a savings of 50%. Uh, 50 now, for those of you that find value in this, a lot of you earlier was asking me, how can I take advantage of this? All right, type in the word, type in the word offer if you, are, if you um, are taking advantage of this today. Now, how do you actually do that? Now, remember, 17 US dollars. Click on this link. Well, my buddy Reed is going to actually go ahead. Reed, can you please be so kind because we're running out of time here? Uh, can you please be so kind? Just send out that link to everybody. Um, okay, and yeah, I see he's doing that right now. He just did. Go ahead, click the link. When you click that link, folks, here's what you're going to see now. You don't have all, you know, all the time in the world, and here's why. How many of you noticed that this offer will expire in zero days, 23 hours? You have less than 23 hours to take advantage of this, folks. Okay, so once again, the time is running out right now. So go ahead, click that link, and by the way, there it is. If any of you are wondering, well, what if this is not for me? Folks, not a problem. We'll give you your money back, no problem. 30-day money-back satisfaction guarantee. Seriously, no questions asked. If it ain't for you, we'll give you your 17 US dollars back. All right? But here's the bottom line, because I've got to get out of here. So performance matters. Take a look. I'm going to fast forward here. Take a look at the results of 2014 since May to December. Take a look at that. Folks, look at the performance on everything that we've done with those live webinars, that boils down to 978 pips or 9,780 US dollars profit, all right, at one standard lot. Just imagine what your results can be, and that's what you have to really imagine and ask yourself. But for 17 US dollars, folks, it doesn't get much better than that, all right? So thank you for joining us uh, today. I had a blast. I'm very excited to have been a part of your learning experience. And once again, folks, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to blast out this link. My time is up here. So uh, Reed, if you could please send that link out once again. And uh, just, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go, but can you all just type in the word link if you actually got the link? Just make sure there was no issues there. Um, so my time is up here. Just, if you could please be so kind, type in the word link, all right? And you can even type in the word offer if you actually took advantage of that today. All right, perfect. Thank you for that. Proud of each and every one of you. A lot of you are taking advantage of that. I'm over. Reed, let me let you back on. I went over my time. Sorry about that. Thank you all once again.